Hi there and welcome back to Aliens vs Predator 2. I'm Baron. Okay. Waiting to turn a deep briefing the incident appendix A summary. On January the 6th at approximately 10 pm the defense system of the forward ports collapsed due to a massive software failure. Records indicate some number of xenomorph drones and runners entered the ports during the 15 minutes of downtime. These reports also mention the loss of archaeological team Omega working at the Site 12 near the Xenomorph Hive. We believe that the focus on saving these men, codenamed Operation Savior, distracted port security from a more immediate threat. We have to liberate the artificial hive. <coughs> okay, so we do that. I think we have to do some wall climbing here. Left or right? Well, probably left. It's always left, apparently. Uh, no, I was running in a circle. Maybe not. I have no idea. I'm, s I'm confused. No, I was not running in a circle. Perhaps. Oh, he said, ah, that's not a funny thing. Somebody saw me. Give me your head. Okay. Uh, as an alien, I can't read. That's sad, but can't be helped. We have to liberate the artificial hive. Free you? Apparently, I can't. All right, moving on. Up or down? Apparently, up. And now what? Okay. Ah, I hate you. Into Major McKinn, my condolences on the loss of Corporal Harrison. We try to control our convict laborers through the use of technology. But as you know, technology can fail. Have you got the son of a bitch yet? It's only a matter of time. Uh, we've identified the last known position of the missing team. I'm afraid the rescue is not without risk. I think we can handle it. Excellent. General Rykov will brief you on the situation. Best of luck. You're lying bastard. Left or right? We got one! Where? Who do you got? What have you got? Okay, we can go down here. No, no, no. Okay. Can't go down here. Surprise! Lunch time. Wait. 
Oh, you already lost your head. Hey, oh. What's that? Somebody melted its way, or his way, or her way, I don't know. Well, that was male or female. Something melted its way down there, but it doesn't seem like we can go anywhere. Oh, yes, we can actually. Okay. Jump. What else do we get? Good, uh huh. Yep. We could also climb down here. That's interesting. Medical teams, please report. Operation Savior is now at yellow status. All Marine personnel report to Major McCain for rescue briefing. So, where do we go now? We could also climb up here. So many choices, but since the levels are probably pretty linear, it will. Uh, either way, it will all amount to the same, lead to the same spot. Or most of. Hey, then we'll be dead end. Ha ha ha! Okay. What would happen if I... Okay, now I'm really at the bot. It's pretty dark in here. Doesn't change much. It's not much to do for us. So that's... there's nothing here. Hey, move it. There's nothing here. There's nothing here. There's someone here. Hello? Okay. Yeah, I'm not hurting you, don't worry. Let's get out. Wall climbing. Okay, I'm pretty positive that they, all those would kill me. So I'm on the elevator now. Uh, no. Uh, what? Shoot! What's the game doing? Where am I supposed to go? Hi. Progress. That other door would not open automatically. No. Okay, progress. I like that a lot. Hey, that, that's an alien. So my guess is we have to climb up here. Come on, come on. Oh. 
Okay, we can destroy that. Let's fuck it up then. Aha! Uh -huh. Why do you kill those scientists? They are no threat to you. Alright, we freed um, that thingy, our brother. Wait, I'm, I'm, I'm trapped. No, re not really, right? Um, what? What am I overlooking? I'm overlooking that. Shit. Where did I come from? Ah! It's pretty dark. Okay. Oh, who opened that door? Medical teams, please report. Operation Savior is now at yellow status. All Marine personnel report to Major McCain for rescue briefing. Yeah, yeah, I know. Come on. Did I get your head? Hmm. Anything else to do here? Apparently not. So you probably should. What are you reading? No, no. Yeah, I'm, I'm quite literate for an alien. Today's spacecraft. Oh, is space travel safe? Yeah, the travel is safe, but no. you can really get your ass kicked on the planets, The Scientific colonist. I can't read that though, okay. Synthetics. No. Moving on. Woo. Heads up. That's a dead end. Wait. Maybe that thing is here. Okay, we could go up here. What's on the other end of that other stair? Boo! They're not letting you in. They're bastards. You could open the door. Try to open the door. I can't open the door. Would you please kind of open the door for me? Fine. Be like that. No, no, no. I take the ventilation shaft then. You Come can't on. do that. I can't do that. Because I'm an alien. Oh, I'm an alien. <sighs> Shit. I really hate that. Um... That would probably kill me. Let's see. No, it doesn't kill me. But it blocks me. So we could go down here. Would That would amount to nothing. So we get up again. No, 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 no. What? Oh, hi. Ah, Eisenberg. Attention all personnel. Please be advised that pod 2 has been placed on red alert status. Xenomorph contaminant confirmed. Command, this is Dr. Eisenberg. What is the situation with the contaminants? We're still tracking one creature, but we think it's isolated in the maintenance system. You think it's isolated? Shall I send security? Rykov has a team nearby. No, of course not. Why not?
Is he hallucinating? Why is blood around his mouth? My God! What the hell did this? Well, Logan, what's going on there? Did you locate the team? What's left of it? One survivor. Uh, looks like the others were. I didn't have a choice. What the hell is that? He ate his other team members. What is wrong with you? Get up. Get up, coward. Are the teams in position? Is the Marine rescue prepared? Yes, the teams are ready. Are you? We have work to do. Okay, so if he was in there, I mean in the past, okay, you remember that when we were, I think a predator, we found those logs about the team before the whole incident started that was r overrun by aliens, Eisenberg was one of them and they didn't have enough food to last till the next shipment of supplies arrives. So he probably ate his dead comrades. Cannibalism for the win. But if there was an alien in the room with him, why didn't it attack him? Weird. Wait into tiny debriefing, the incident appendix A summary. Based on the crude analysis of the events at the forward parts, some have linked the loss of the artificial hive to Operation Savior. Such attempts to create poetic justice from mere coincidence should be summarily ignored, as if aliens could have known of the savior plans or have reacted intelligently to such behavior. Clearly such theories stretch the bounds of xenomorph abilities. Okay, we still have to liberate the artificial hive. Heads up. Boo, yeah, heads up. Ah. Oh, well. oh, hi. Don't worry, I'm not hurting unarmed personnel. I'm a nice alien. If such a thing can actually exist. Oh, this is where Eisenberg was laying around doing nothing. Two teams still haven't reported in. If we don't isolate this bastard quick, I'm gonna give the evacuation order. I don't think Eisenberg will go for that. I'm not gonna ask him. That's good. Those smart guns are no fun at all. So, what now? It's pretty dark in here. Ah, that's probably where I have to go. Can I fuck up this place a little? Okay. All right, time to do some wall climbing. That was awesome. Try again. First, the good news. Four hours ago, Marine rescue team arrived at the forward pods. Despite their inadvertent disruption of our security grid, we are now safer than ever. In fact, even as we speak, 
Our six weeks of isolation is coming to an end. The Marines have restored our landline to the primary complex, and thus a link to their mothership and the universe at large. Now the bad news. As you may have heard, one of our archaeological teams has become trapped near the Hive. To extricate the team, the Doctor feels we must neutralize the Hive. That means capturing and controlling the Empress. Yes, I understand your concern, but we have studied this eventuality. Next. As you know, the majority of the Hive extends above the Empress's chamber. Our people are trapped near the outer edge. Next. The operation begins with a surface assault on the Hive as a diversion. No humans are involved in this initial action. We'll be relying on a strike team of combat synthetics. Yet, as I have said, this is only a feint. As the Hive responds to the surface attack, two things will occur. First, a Marine team will penetrate the Hive here to rescue our comrades. Second, an extraction team will break through from the tunnel system here, at the base of the Hive. Our probes have mapped this area extensively. By tunneling in here, we breach a large horizontal shaft that runs directly into the Empress Chamber. This shaft will serve as our roadway for extracting her. We expect the Hive to respond aggressively to the human threats, particularly that on the Empress. By destroying the tunnels of the Hive, the combat synths will cut off the Empress from any assistance, allowing a quick and bloodless escape back to the tunnels below. Meanwhile, our Marine allies easily and safely extract our comrades. Any questions? Based on what you've described, it would seem our defenses would be considerably diminished after the attack. What if the Hive retaliates? The sympathetic theory of pheromone relationships, as put forward by Dr. Eisenberg, is quite clear on this point. The Hive will respond to the command of the Empress, and the Empress will respond to her own instinctive drive for survival. Once we have the Empress as hostage, we will be protected from the Hive. Protected during the extraction or protected long term? Are you saying we would then have safe access to the entire Hive and to artifact technology there? We believe that we are looking at a long-term insurance policy. For those of you whose projects have been frustrated due to incomplete archaeological or biological data, this would present something of an unprecedented opportunity. Chen's theory of competitive discourse clearly indicates that the Hive will react violently to the loss of the Empress. At a minimum, the young queens will struggle to determine a new Ascendant ruler. More likely, the Hive will come after us. Who is that? Is it you, Minkus? Well, as you can see, Dr. Chin is not with us to discuss his theory. A rather good indication of its staying power. Well, where is he, anyway? Yes, well... To continue with the briefing, we may expect some injuries during such an ambitious enterprise. I'm asking anyone with medical training to assist with any potential triage. Any other questions? Apparently not. That's quite a bold plan, but I think if the queen is gone, uh, a new queen will emerge. What's your status there? Nothing to report. Send a containment team. Send a containment team. Yeah, yeah, continue. I didn't want to interrupt you. Oh well. It's still freaking dark. Up or down? Probably down. Horido or not? Um, what am I overlooking? Oh, there's an opening here. Oh, fuck it. That will probably kill us. Let's try. Yes. Um, no. With me. Can't go in here. Can't go in here. I'm sorry. Oh, there's an opening. No. I don't like it when you. Okay. 
jump. No shit, that didn't work because I was still wall climbing. Boo. Why is that alarm going off? I'm not sure, sir. Never mind. Just shut the system down. We're supposed to get anything done. Here. Boo. Let's go. That's why the alarm is going off. And here we have that predator. See, uh, do you remember when we that that's we actually uh, as the predator in the predator campaign? Do you remember when we were in that um, prison-like thingy? We saw an alien up here, and later Harrison runs around here down there. So that's how the three campaigns are linked. You actually see yourself in another campaign. I'm gonna fuck things up. And climb here. Later there will be a disc here that Harrison takes. Hello, Mr. Predator. Don't worry, you're gonna be released soon. Jesus has nothing to do with that. Oh, really? Up? Or down? Probably up. Shhh. I really hate that. I mean, it would be awesome if you could, like, stick to one wall and not, you know, switch walls accidentally. I don't mind research on the drones, but I think we're crossing an ethical line with this. These things are clearly intelligent. I'm sorry. Didn't quite hear you. Um, I guess I have to... Oh, see, there's a hole. Jesus. Move it! Move it? <laughs> Who's gonna move anything? <laughs> no, can't destroy it. Samples and let's get the hell out of here. Yeah, let's get the hell out of here. Can I free you? Could jump up or go down. Shit. Those mod guns are no fun at all. What's up with you here? Where to now? I'm overlooking something. Oh, hi. Where did you come from? I'm somewhat confused. Again. Could we open that? Probably not. Security alarm. Go on. No, we can't open that. That's no, just no, stupid. No. Hmm. Again, I'm stuck. Oh, damn it. Where to now? That's another dead end.
<laughs> Do we have to move that around somewhat? Aha! Uh -huh. mm. Thanks, you could have been more of a help here. Okay, so that's what we have to do and we will jump through that hole in the next video. So, thank you very much for watching and see you soon. Bye.